Hi. <laughs> okay. Hi, guys. It's Melanie from Windmill Vintage Designs. I have this all figured out. We are on the, the computer computer. So that's cool. We're um, just going to have to. Anyways, like I have this. I've got it. So as you come in, I'm going to wait for a few minutes. Make sure you guys are coming in. Make sure that you can see me and hear me. Hopefully everything is doing good. So Facebook people, YouTube people, please tell me like if you're here and um, how this is looking, if you can hear me, all that stuff. Meanwhile, I'm going to go ahead and let you guys know. So the way we're going to do this, we are going to, you know what? I can't see comments. Folders, banner, comments. There we go. Oh, yay, you're here. Okay. Uh, better, let's see. Yay, it works. Yay, hi. Okay. Hi, guys. Okay. Okay, cool. So the way we're going to do this um, is if you see something that you would like to purchase, if you would like it to be yours or make it a forever home, <laughs> what I need you to do is text my husband at 702-860-8861. You should be able to see that at the bottom of the screen there. I hope that you can. Again, I'm going to say it. It's 702-860-8861. Okay. So let's go with that. So say for instance, let's just give an example. Say for instance, I said black mink scarf. Okay. Which is actually, you know, I'm not, I'm not totally down with the mink thing, but you know, this guy's been gone for a long time. Somebody should enjoy it. And say for instance, you wanted this, then you would text Hamish and you would say, Hey, this is Susie, and I would like the black mink scarf. And then that way he can get your email from you, and we can make sure that we send you an invoice and that this is yours. So the first person who does that is going to get it, okay? Okay, let's see. Working on YouTube. Yay. Okay. Hi, Veronica. Hi, Rebecca, Margarita, Arlene, Janet. Hi. So far, so good. A little blurry on my end, but probably just me. Hopefully, hopefully it's not horrible. Okay, so does everybody feel like they kind of got the groove of like how we're going to do this? I hope. I wish. Um, okay, Veronica says K. Okay, so let's start. You want to start? Okay. Oh, yeah. So I want you guys to hang in there with me. I am going to have some trivia questions for you. And you will be getting free items for women winning those trivia questions, okay? Now, the only thing about that is that you need to have purchased or will purchase something else. So I can put that free item in the box to ship it to you, okay? That's my only. But whoever answers the trivia first is going to win some free stuff. So we're going to do that intermittently throughout this, make it kind of fun, give you guys some cool free stuff. Okay. Yay. Hi, Irma. Okay. Here we go. Yes. And Mandy, you can definitely, you are good. I don't know why it's blocking your comment. That's weird. Show. Can I say Yes, Mandy, you can. Um, so Miranda, wait, Mandy is on YouTube. Hey, Mish, are you are you watching YouTube? So Mandy is in Australia and she can't text. And if she says she wants something, then she's like, can she say it on here? Because she, you know what I mean, like the international texting. Okay, so Mandy, Hamish is going to watch YouTube just for you. Okay. Um, that way he can watch out for something that you would like so we can get you hooked up. Okay, cool. Let's just, I have this in my hand, so we're going to start with this. This is a mink scarf. It's got one, two, it's got these little pom-pom dailies on it on the end. Um, and it's, it's really, really pretty. And it has 
where is it? Has a slit right here. So you take this dude and you stick it in here. It's a little bourgeois, but it's really, really pretty. If anybody, it's a great example to start, would like a mink, 100% mink scarf, it is $32. So if you wanted it, you would say $32 mink scarf to Hamish. You're going to text 702-860-8861. Asking, so if I need to watch this on the iPad to text from. Okay. Yeah, so just text that number. Hamish has a iPhone. Is an iPhone. Hi, Catherine and Deborah and Terry. Okay. Okay. So that's item number one. We're going to go ahead and put the mink scarf uh, right here. I'm going to put it right there. So even after, if you were watching the replay, um, maybe the mink scarf isn't sold. If that's something you wanted, you can still text Hamish and it's still going to be checked to see if it's available. Okay. Okay. Let's go ahead and start with the flannels because those seem to do pretty well. You guys seem to like them. So we're going to start with this one. Well, I don't want to start with that one. That's the last one. Let's start with this one. <laughs> I like to go in order. Okay. So here we go. This is, this is a men's large flannel. Okay. These are dipped. It has the coloring. So you've got like a pinky, kind of a mauvey, then a little bit of tanny, and it goes into like a very light coral and white. Um, can I say I want, oh, that was still you, Mandy. Okay. Okay, Mandy. Mandy wants item number one, mint scarf, babe. Yes. Okay, Mandy, we'll get that one for you. This is B, flannel B, and it is men's large. If anyone wants this one, we need to do that. Flannel B, men's large. I looks a little sloppy because I left the pocket open so I can put the little tag right back in here. All these flannels are really pre-washed and super, super soft and good. And now the screen's too high. Let's see. I'm going to tip it. Hey, that might be better, huh? Okay, just like that. They're very fun. Okay, so let's keep moving here. We're just going to burn through the flannels, guys, and then we'll go. There's a lot more stuff, but I want to show you these ones. So this is number C. It's a men's large, and it has like a, what would you call this, honey? Green? Yeah, greenish. Like a greeny greenish tan? Greenish, yeah. yeah, greeny, towny, brownie here. And then it goes into like corals and creams little bit of more of an orange over here. This is a men's large and it's item number C. Somebody likes this one, you gotta text Hamish, okay? Okay, putting that one back. This one. This one is super cool. I just love these burnt colors. This one's one of my favorites. This one's made by Vans. It's a woman's large. It is item number D woman's large so it has like a lots of burns and it just goes a little bit lighter definitely one of my favorites and i love vans brand you know so that is that one item number d or flannel d i guess hey sweetie i need larges okay i have some don't you worry okay so this one here is not dipped but it's still really cool i love these colors it's like purples and um bohemian blue it's like bohemian blue and purple it's really really pretty this is a woman's large it's item e flannels e women's large this one is very cool it's very comfortable and i i like the cut it's um still large but it's feminine Soul D. Okay, are you texting Hamish? So you want to text Hamish and say what you need to say, your name and what flannel you want, okay? Okay. All right. Moving right along. So this is a men's large. This one's pretty cool too. This is F. Flannel F. It's a men's large. The phone number isn't there. It's 702. 
8861. Let's see. Banners. Oh, look, I'm all touching the screen like it's a phone. Ding dong. <laughs> oh, I'm not used to using the computer. There you go. <laughs> Thanks, Janet. <laughs> it's such a ding dong. Okay. Here's the number, guys. 702-860-8861. I can, seriously cannot believe I was just seriously touching the computer screen. What a dork. Okay. <laughs> so this, this one here is a large regular. It's men's. It's made by L.L. Bean. And it's F. Men's F large. So if you wanted that one, he would go, oh, I did it again. Babe, I just touched it again. <laughs> Are you guys there? Am I back, honey? Okay, because I, um, somebody take this mouse away from me. <laughs> huh? Oh, heck. Sorry, guys, they're $22 free shipping. <laughs> Forgot to tell you the most important part, right? Okay. I um well I swiped left on the mouse and I got rid of myself. I like threw myself away. I am so sorry. Okay. I'm back. Yes. I don't know what to tell you guys. Melanie, this is Melanie. I don't know what to say. Okay. This is F. It's a men's large. All right, let's move on to the next one. So if you want that one, you text Hamish and say flannel number F or letter F men's large. Okay. This one here is pretty cute this is a woman's large it's grays shades of grays and then it goes down to like oranges and yellows this is flannel letter i <laughs> so if you wanted this one you'd say flannel letter i they're all 22 dollars, and these guys all ship for free so 22 dollars free shipping okay this one is super cute this is flannel J. It's a small, a woman's small, and it is like yellow. It's like a burnt, a burnt yellow and a gray it goes down to corals and stuff. And it's cute. It's got a smiley on the arm. Am I back? Are you guys seeing me okay now? I hope so. Okay, so this is J. If you wanted it, it's a woman's small. Put that back in that pocket. For identification purposes, we could switch to a hat. Let's see. Look how cute. Okay. This is a really super cute sun hat. Watch. Look how cute this is. Hold on. Oh, wait. I'm going to do it like that so you can see. This is really cute. It's coral. It has polka dot little band on it. It's in great, great, great condition because Melanie bought it and never wore it, but it's adorable. So if anyone would like this, you could say coral, straw, sun hat, I'm guessing it's straw. And this guy is $8. If anyone would like a coral straw sun hat, $8. I'm happy to have you here, Catherine. Okay, here's another one. This one is just all straw. It's got a really cute um, uh, crochet pattern, I guess. I love it. Well, let's switch it up and put that guy on. And you are ready to go somewhere. <laughs> so this guy is $8 too. You could say cream straw, sun hat, $8 if you would like this one. Okay. Let's move on here. 
This is another one of my favorites. I have to, you know, I can't keep all these guys, so I have to um, let them go. This is a small. This is flannel number or letter K. It's grays and then it goes down to some beautiful burnt oranges. Grays, blacks, beautiful burnt oranges. So this is K, it's a small, $22 free shipping. All right. This is a men's extra large. This one is really pretty too. It's got, um, let's see, it's got mermaid tail and old 57. We've got some black, a little bohemian blue. And then we fade down into some lighter of the same shades. Hi, Pam. This is L, letter L, and it's a men's extra large. Everything working out, guys? I hope. Okay, let's keep going. We're almost, we've got one, two, three, four, five, six more flannels, and then we're gonna move on. Okay, here we go, like oranges and stuff. We go down to some really light. This one's really pretty, very soft. This is letter M. It's a men's large, letter M. If you are interested in this one, the original maker is Croft and Barrow. Okay, this one here is N. This is flannel letter N. It's a men's extra large, lots of reds and blacks going down into some burnts down here, burnt colors. So you remember you would text Hamish with the letter and what flannel you wanted, okay? $22 free shipping on the flannels, guys. Okay. This is, this is actually a girl's. Um, so it's marked like extra large 1416. So this is gonna be for your younger ladies. This is P. So it's a girl's and it's got some really cool colors in there too. If you want that one. Okay, let's see. So here we have some reds. This one is a small. This is letter Q, ladies flannel, small. You've got lots of reds fading down a little bit. This one didn't um, didn't take the bleach so well, so it didn't fade a lot, just faded a little. It's very still, I love it. Okay, last flannel. Okay guys, so on when you're texting Hamish, he needs to know what letter flannel you wanted and who you are. He's gotta know who you are so he can keep track of you in his phone, okay? So um, if you can, if you have texted him already, please go back and say the flannel letter that you wanted and, and who you are. Um, I'm Jackie, I'm Janet, I'm Rebecca, I'm Carla, just so that Hamish can keep you guys straight because um, otherwise he's not gonna know who you are. <laughs> know what I mean? Okay, so go back and text him now, please, and with the letter that you wanted and um, and who you are. Pam Dudley, there was a small one that was tan and pinks. Pam wanted that one. Small one with tan, wait, let me do this one real quick, Pam. This is a lady small. This is Lucky Brand, and it is letter S. Lady small, letter S, Lucky Brand. Okay, I love Lucky Brand. I don't know about you guys, but pretty much love everything Lucky Brand. So what did you say, Pam? Pam, there was a small one that was tan and pinks. Here? Where? At the large. Small, tan, and pinks. I don't know which one you're thinking of, Pam. Was it this one? It's Oh, Pam, are you talking about this one? This one is a small, and it is J, letter J. So tell Hamish that one, okay? If that's the one you're thinking of. Okay, so let's do, 
Who wants to do a trivia question? It, it was here, Pam. So you it, that had to be that one, I think. So anybody want to do a trivia question? Will I try on the men's large to see how big? Yeah. Okay, Pam, I don't know what to say, honey. They're all the same ones that were here. Let's see. Men's large. So this one is a men's large. If I put it on. Oh, I don't know. It's because I want to see it on probably on my frame. Oh, still buttoned back there. It had blues and pinks, Pam. I don't know, honey. I'm sorry. Let's see. So men's I'm all <laughs> men's large. Okay, come on, Melanie. You, oh, that's as far down as I can put it. Does that help? So on me. Where is it? I usually, well, I always unbutton these guys right here, but I would wear it like, like that. And it's really not too bad because. No, I don't like that one. No. What? Blues and pinks. Oh, maybe. So that is, that's your men's large on Melanie. Letter P1. Can you try that one on, Pam? Sure. Why not? Hang up, baby. Which one? Let her pee the girls one. Okay. That was, yeah, this one. You're about the same size as me, Pam, right? You might be a little bit smaller than me. Not too far off, I don't think. So this is the girls extra large. Let her pee. And it's going to fit. Just like that. So depending on your bust size, around you know that area might be a little too um, might fit just right. I don't know. And like that. So that is the girls extra large. Letter P. A small. You want me to try on another one? Pam, you can come over too, silly girl. Okay. Let's try on a small. Hold on. So this is a small. This one's made by Faded Glory. I know it's probably one of my favorites. And I love this one. It's so cool. Well, that is this one. What is it called? This is a lady small and it's letter K. If you liked this one. I love it. Look how cute too. You could even like, or just do like the little tuckeroo right there. Ladies K. Okay. We're going to get to those bead bracelets for reals, Deborah. Okay. So let's move past the finals and keep it moving. This one has a number two. Oh, hell. Oh, well. Oh, Lord. Okay. I'm sorry. Okay, what do we want to do now? Oh, trivia. So you guys ready? Okay, so the first person to answer this question, I'm going to be looking right here. So the first one to have it come through is going to win a free item with their purchase, okay? So tell me, tell me. Let's see. Let's see how much you guys know. How, what kind of pets do I have? How? Yeah, tell me. <laughs> okay, so like species wise, okay, you don't have to like how many I have of each one, but how many do I have? Like, does that make sense? Dogs and cats. And yeah, like dogs and cats and like pigs. So I have a pig, you know what I mean? Like, what kind of pets do I have? Dogs and turtles. Okay, that's one answer, but that that's not right. <laughs> Catherine from M5. Like, I don't want to know the number. <clears throat> I want to know, like, what kind? What kind? And a cat. <laughs> okay, you got to say it all in one thing. Like, whoever says it first, it's going to win. <laughs> Pam said goat. Oh, that's rad. It's goat. Dogs, turtles, and cats. Catherine Pittman, you are the lucky winner. 
Okay, Catherine got it right. So I do. I have two dogs, one cat, and a lot of turtles. Okay, so Catherine, Catherine Pittman is the winner of the first, okay? Please remember that. Okay. Okay. All right, so you want to see some bracelets. Okay, so this one's mine. You can't have this one. <laughs> but I'm going to show you some other ones. So these are hand-beaded bracelets made by Michelle Tapia. They are absolutely beautiful. I'll try to get you up here close. They have all this detail, wonderful, and they she does make them to fit whatever sized wrist you may have. So let's pull these guys out. Let's see if I can make some room here. I'll try not to swipe myself away again. Okay, we're gonna start with these ones. Okay, so we have these two available. They're absolutely beautiful. These guys are $100 and they ship for $5. So $105 total. On here, if you would like one, so you can see the colors. I think they're, I think they're displaying pretty well. This has got the red and it's got a little bit of a um, native kind of a scroll across there. This one here is a little more vintage looking. And if you get these bigger ones right here are actually roses. They're really, really pretty. So these guys are $100 and they ship for five. So that's 105. So if you would like one of these, you would say large beaded bracelet. Then you would say red or rose. Large beaded bracelet, red or rose. Text that to Hamish if you would like one of those. They are gorgeous. These were such a hit when um, the ladies were here. All of them went home. I mean, they they went, they were like magnets to them. So Debbie, Dion, Kenise, everybody left with one of these guys like immediately. So those are the large ones. Here we go on the medium size. So these ones are a little bit th thinner than the large. And these are 75. So if you were interested in one of these, let's see if I can hold it straight. Right there. Okay. So let's start. And of course, it's reverse on the screen. So if you're interested in one of these, this is beautiful. Let's see if I can turn it. There we go. This is silver and turquoise. It's 75. So you would text Hamish and say silver and turquoise medium bracelet. And don't forget your name. Also, okay, so that is that one. This one here has all kinds of beautiful colors in it. You can see that pattern is gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. Oh, how would we identify this one? You're gonna say M18, M18. For this, it's $75, ships for $5, M18. This one is gorgeous. It has some translucent stones with color. Absolutely beautiful. This one is M19. If you were interested in this one, you would say M19. Okay. Hold on, let me get the phone number back up there for you guys without turning myself off. Look at that, I'm learning. Okay. Okay, so let's go. This one has purples, greens, and some gold. This one is absolutely beautiful. $75, $5 shipping, and this is M17. You text that to Hamish if you liked it. This one is M16, turquoise and blue and gold and white. Absolutely beautiful. And they all look so good. I'm not gonna put them all on because that would take time that we don't have, but they are just so pretty. Hi, Michelle. I'm glad you're here. Okay, so that was M16. All right, this one is beautiful. We've got these vibrant yellows and blues and turquoises. 
This one is 75 and it's M14. Do you remember, these are handmade. Michelle Tapia is sitting there beading these guys. Has anybody ever made beaded jewelry before? I haven't. I don't have the patience for it. And this girl is so talented and I can't even imagine how many hours it takes to just make one bracelet. So we have to respect her beautiful, beautiful, beautiful work. Okay, so those are those. I do have more sizes of the bracelets. If anybody would like to see them, please give me a give me a shout out and let me know. Okay, I'm going to show you. This is a really, really fun, fun thing. So this is a super cool artist bag that I found. Absolutely love it. So let me show you. This is all leather. It is solid as all get up. Carry it like that, right? And in this wonderful artist bag, you open these guys up so well, like the leather's all soft and good. <laughs> I agree with you, Michelle. It's very um, time consuming and you need to be like spot on. Like these are spot on, there's no errors. You would think what factory made them. So look how cool. So this opens like this. Oh, any of our artists that are around. And it has all these slots, which are absolutely perfect to put your paintbrushes and paints and tubes and all that stuff in. This is a super cool find. Smells fabulous, like vintage leather. It does have, um, let's see, let me get it back on there. Whoever the original artist was had their letters. I'm assuming that's the that's their initials inscribed. Can you see it in there? And the little top goes right over the back. So this guy is $45 and it costs $15 to ship it. So if anybody would like the cool artist bag, that's what it is. You would just text Hamish and you would say artist bag. It's $45. Don't forget to put your name, okay? So we know who you are. So that is it. You can see how big it is to me. So pretty decent size. Carry it like that. All right. So that is that. Let's go to how do you guys feel about? Let's do some vintage stuff. So this is cute. This is a marble vintage jewelry box. And it's very fun. It's got um that up there, cool flowers on it. It's, I would say, 40s, 50s probably. From there, this little guy is $14. It's gonna ship for five. If anybody's interested in this, you would say marble, marble jewelry box, and $14 ships for five. All right, let's check out, how about these? So I have just one of these left. This is a cool embroidered mask they're very fun they um only have one left <laughs> they're nine dollars and this one's gonna ship for like i don't know three bucks something like that if anybody would like the one it is turquoise teal mermaid tail however you want to say it it's nine dollars embroidered mask super cute i don't think you want me to put it on my face though because that's not cool if you're gonna buy it so if anybody wants this guy that's what it is this is the only one i have they've already sold out so that is that Let's see, let's do this. Okay, hold on guys, how you guys doing? Everybody doing okay? My grandma used to have those on her battery for, yes, they're fun, huh? You know, I love them. That one is was actually my great grandma's. My great grandma passed away when I was 15. So that means that is, I don't even know, I'm 46, you guys do the math, it's super duper old. Okay. Hold on, let's do, what should we do now, Mer? Uh, I don't know what you have. Bed. Are you doing the beds? Sure, let's do these. Okay, so these are super fun. These are really, really cool hobo bags. Um, they're pretty, like, 
vintage looking. They've got that whole feel from like the 70s, I guess, right? Okay, so this is cool. This one has a skull on it or a clowny, a clowny kind of skull. They have pockets on the band. It has, let's see, a little button closure right here. Inside, you have a zipper pocket, and it also has a zipper close, so a zipper close, so your stuff doesn't just like spill out. Carla got herself one of these today when she was in the store, but really fun. So you are ready to shop. And of course, if the band you felt was too long, you just tie that up and sew. So this one is Hobo Bag number one, and it is $22. It ships for five. So Hobo Bag number one, $22, ships for five. You can text Hamish and tell him that. All right, I have another one that's the same. I think it's the same, right? No, this one's a little bit different. The coloring is a little different. It's got more yellows here. The other one had pinks here. This is Hobo Bag number three, $22, ships are five. And they're really, really great bags. Again, little pocket on the thing, little thing here. Put it on here. Okay, that is that. We have a couple different other ones. Okay, so this is another hobo pack. We have the cute peace sign there in the front. This one is hobo bag number four. Same thing, button button closure, zip inside, and a little zip pocket inside there too. This one's super cute, and it does have a pocket on the side. So this one was hobo bag number four. Okay. This one is super fun, and this is the only one I have of this one. Because Carla got the other one. Just kidding. It's really cute. It has it on the band again and inside. And this one has a zipper pocket right here, too, on the front. So this one is super cute. This is Hobo Bag number five. And I think you guys would like it. It's very fun. Okay, let's do. So these are fun. So you guys remember, um, yeah, they would be great for yard sales, huh? You can put so much stuff in them. You remember these? Somebody tell me what these are. Super fun. So while I was thrifting with Debbie in California, we picked these up. It's so cute. So to wear under your dresses, your short dresses, so your your tushy doesn't show when you bend over. You could be really cute. Bloomers, I know, aren't they adorable? They're all still in really good shape. They are clean. <laughs> and they are, I don't even know how old. You guys tell me how old. Um, so this one, if you liked this one, they're all $22. Okay, they're going to ship for five. I have four pairs. This one, it says is a medium. So. These, if I was to put these on under my skirt right now, these would fit me just fine, just fine. They're all going to be a little bit high-waisted because that's the way they rolled back in the day, right? So you'd say bloomers. These look, also look great in your store for staging. If any of you guys have booths, these are just adorable for staging and um, really, really good. So $22 ships for three to five right there. And this is the medium, and it's like an orange. We'll see. Let's go through. I kind of really like this one. This is black. Same, pretty much. A little bit different on the ruffles. You can see the ruffle pattern there, but these are all in good shape. They're not all stretched out or anything. This one, again, is $22 and it has no tag, but it feels more like a small to me. So this one would be a small. So you would text Hamish and you would say black bloomers. This is white. These ones are really cute, and I really love how the legs on these are longer. Um, so they would definitely show more under your, your skirt. So really, really cute. Um, this one, the tag is faded out, but you would say white bloomers are $22.
And that is it. Of course, if you guys are local, you can come pick it up. There won't be any shipping, okay? Okay, so now we have lavender. These guys are going to be a bit bigger. Let's see. No tag. Ladies were ripping out their tags. They must have been itching them. So this one's a bit bigger. I would say it's a large to an extra large probably. Lavender. So you would say lavender bloomers to Hamish, okay? These are just adorable. I'm pretty stoked. I don't even wear skirts very often. I have one on today, but I don't wear them very often, but I'm kind of kind of thinking I might just so that I can have some cute bloomers showing underneath my underneath my stuff. Okay, let's, what else should we do? Um, sure, you guys want to do another trivia? They are so cute, huh? I used to wear those as a teen. My dad would make me, see? Isn't that awesome, Michelle? <laughs> they are so cute. Okay. okay, all right. Here's trivia question for you. So this is trivia question number two. Who won the first one? Good job. Okay. Tell me what the name of one of my dogs is. You just got to do one. Whoever says one of my dog's names first wins the next free present with your purchase. All right. Tell me, tell me, what is one, just one of my dog's names, dead or alive? <laughs> Foxy's close, Mel. Roxy. All right. Melanie Mel one. Roxy, Roxy. Okay, good job, dude. Okay, so let's look at this guy. Look at this beautiful turquoise necklace. So oh, let's do it like this, like this. So you can actually see this is one of Cheryl's pieces. Cheryl has consignment jewelry in my store. It's absolutely beautiful. This guy is $90 and it ships for free. Let's see. Let me hold it up. It's got the most beautiful sterling chain. You can see it's that twisted. It has the coolest little dude here. I don't know if there's a special name for that that holds it on. And look at the stone. It's just absolutely gorgeous. So this guy is $90 and it ships for free. If you would like this one, you could say. Hi, Mel, you're on. Um, you could say you want the turquoise cross. It's just gorgeous. And again, it's all sterling. Beautiful, beautiful. It's called a bell. Thank you, Rhonda. It's got a beautiful bell. It actually looks like a little saddle. Very cool. The intricacy on the um, metal is great. Okay, so let's do, we did that one. Here, let's let's pick up a vintage one. This one is cool. So I picked this up. Who remembers these guys? Tell me, tell me. This owl is in really great vintage condition. It's super fun. All its little things move correctly. I just love it. I remember my mom wearing these like early, early on. Like when I was little, little. So I was born in 74. So my mom was probably wearing these in like 70. I don't know, 78, something like that. Super cool. So this cool owl here, of course, this is adjustable. You can move it up and have to be down to your belly button. I don't know if you guys have seen this one. He has black stone eyes. He is $21. So you could say vintage owl. He's $21 and he's going to ship for just a couple bucks, like not too much. I know. He's awesome, huh, Mel? So that is that guy. And let's see. He's fairly decent sized. Almost as big as my hand. Okay. Let's see, how about this? So these are, I'm gonna go through three of these real quick. So these are the baskets that I make. So these are handmade by Melanie. Um, here is one, it's got some black um, buffalo like plaid stitching in there. It is as big as my head, it's collapsible. Go back out, got your cute little handles and little beads on there. This one right here is $25. It's gonna ship for like seven, okay? We'll smush it up and put it in the box. So if you would like this little basket, you would say rope basket, $25, okay? To Hamish, white and black on this one, if you wanted it. 
All right, here's another one. This one's quite a bit heavier. This one's gonna ship for 10. This, this is um, much thicker rope. Okay, this again, handmade by Melanie. It's got the both strands on either side. You can carry it like that if you would like to. This little guy is 25 again. So if you want the white basket, you can text Hamish, white basket, okay? Let's put those over there, sweetie. Okay, last for the baskets. This is gonna be my largest one. Again, these are all handmade by me. You may see some errors here and there. I don't know what to tell you. Um, like I said, they're handmade. This one is really cool. I think it's really pretty. This is like tan and black. It has the zigzag stitch in there. And this one doesn't have any handles. It has handles, but it does have the cute little tassel. This one is 40 and it's gonna ship for 10. Again, they weigh a lot because this is real rope. We'll smush it to ship it, but it still weighs, you know, so you gotta go by the weight. If you wanted this larger one, you could say zigzag tan and black. And again, it's $40, okay? Anybody like that guy? Okay, let's see, what do we wanna do now? How about, how about these? Okay, so how fun is this? Who likes pinup girls? Tell me, tell me. Oh, thanks Mel, it's fun. You know, um, yeah, I'm gonna make more, I broke my, I gotta get a new needle for my sewing machine. <laughs> okay, so here we have some really cool pinup girls. These are vintage, they are, are some of them mag are, not magazine, um, calendar clips. So in this, this whole set right here, there's five of them and they are $25 for all five, okay? And then it will ship for five. So you get this girl. This is like five by seven-ish size. You get this girl who is again a five by seven, seven inch, five by seven-ish. Okay, this one which is eight by 10 and it is she pretty. They're all so pretty. I love pin of girls. They're just kind of going on classy. You get this girl and you get this girl. Okay. So this, you get all five of them for $25. Okay. If you would like the pin up girls, um, then text Hamish Mel. It takes me like an hour and a half, two hours, maybe three to, um, if everything goes good with the sewing machine, it's not as bad, but yeah, it's a lot of, um, sewing, a lot of sewing on those baskets. Okay. So those are the pinup girls. Let's see what else we could show you guys. So these are pretty cool. These I picked up. This is a vintage clasp bracelet. I think they're gorgeous. So you can see all those beads. And it's like a bronzy kind of a metal. Open like that. And there you go. I think it's just gorgeous. So this is one of them. Um, vintage class. This is $9. It's going to ship for like four to five, like right around there, okay? You got to put it in the box and ship it out. So that is that one. You could say vintage clasp bracelet number one for this one. I hope you can see doing justice on just how gorgeous it is. I love all the colors. Love it. So this one is similar, but it has just a little bit more bling and a different shape. So you, this is vintage class. This one has an actual rose shape on there, and it's got the little danglies. So that makes it a little different from the other one. So this is the vintage rose. Again, it does open like that. So, oops, I think it should have gone like this. Let's see. There we go. And they just look really pretty. They just like settle, like right there. Just like, there. <laughs> like that. <laughs> okay, so those are the vintage clasp bracelets. Let's do, let's see what you guys think about these. So Melanie has been messing with some leather lately. And I'm trying to learn. I don't know if you guys know Bonnie England, but she's been kind of trying to teach me. And I've been trying my hand at leather work a little bit. So here I have, this is $8 wallet, okay? And it's just a little snap. So it's perfect for like, 
your credit, like, so what I do when I don't want to carry my bag, my big bag, I just stick this guy, it just has like my credit cards and my ID in there. And then I can stick it in my back pocket. I can stick it here. I can stick it wherever I want it. So this little guy, $8, this is my, this is the size of wallet that I carry all the time. So if you would like this little wallet, you would just say $8, um, tan. Price for that vintage rose, the bracelet was, um, they're nine, nine dollars. This guy, Zef. Okay, you guys texting Hamish, I hope. Okay, so there's that one. I also made another one that is brown, darker leather. This is Italian leather and it's super soft. Again, it's just big enough to fit your credit cards and some cash in and you can slip it wherever you want and off you go. This guy is $9, so you would just say brown wallet, $9. To Hamish, okay? Let's see. I also made these. They are really cool little cuffs if you're interested in the cuffs. These guys are all $5. There's a few different kinds. So this one is tan and turquoise with a little turquoise bead on there. So you would say tan turquoise little. This one has like some little, um, I don't know, I'm going to call them jewels for lack of a better word right now. We have this one, $5. And this one is brown and then with a pink leather. Again, it's a little snap. Another one that I made, $5. Okay. Moving on. So Melanie Mel won that second one. So this is kind of a cool find. No, if anybody can tell me exactly from back in the day, this is vintage glass vessel. We're going to call it a vessel for lack of a better. Yes, I can. All three? Okay. Okay. So the first one I showed was the black and white basket, the two handles. It's got the little beads right here. It's kind of shapeable. You can kind of swish it. You can push it back out and have it be nice and round. I personally kind of like it like that. So that is the first one. So this is the black and white. The second one is just white. A lot heavier. It's got a lot thicker of a rope. This is a lot thicker and it's a nylon. That's cotton. This is nylon. Does that help, Penny? Okay. I hope that helps, guys. Hi, Vicki. Okay. What were we doing? Tell me. Oh, yeah. So this dude right here, um, Blue Vessel, super old, and it's absolutely in immaculate condition. This guy is 15 bucks. Anybody, it's got the um, the fleur on there, but I don't know exactly what the, there's a name for this glass, but I don't know what it is. So this guy's $15. It's going to ship for five. And that one, you would say Blue Vessel with Fleur de Lure on it. Fleur de lure. Okay, this one's really cool. This is left in China. This is also my great grandma's, so it's old, really old. Um, it's in great shape. There's no chips or anything missing from it. All the beadwork is there. This guy is going to cost about five, seven dollars to ship, and it's fifteen dollars. So you would say pink jewelry box left in if you liked this guy. Okay. Let's go. I did make, I have a couple pairs of earrings that I made. These are really cute. Let's see if I can do it. So these guys are $5. They look like that. There is one pair available and they have the pink leather with the brown leather on top. So $5 if you would like Melanie's handmade earrings. Let's see. This is cool. Uh, let's, you know what? Let's skip it. Let's change it up. Hold on. 
Have you, we did the shirts first, Elsa. Is it called Less to Wear Mouth? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. How about, uh, let's do this. So these are really cute. These are your um, hand woven shopping totes. Look how cute these are. So they're, they are hand woven in Mexico. Cute, cute, cute tote like that. Love them. They have the very non traditional colors, which are awesome. Okay. So if you liked this one, this is tote number two. It's $15 and it's going to ship to you for $8 for a grand total of $33, which is still really, really cheap. So if you like this one, it is tote number two. I know they're just too fun. Look, just like, anyways, really, really cute. So then we have this one is the same one. This would be tote number three. Okay. And again, these guys are $15 going to ship to you for eight. Oh, very cute. And yeah, it just opens, but it does have this little button closure right here. We have one more. This is tote number one. This is more traditional Southwestern colors. Very, very cute and fun. And they're super soft, hand-woven totes. I hope you like them because I really want to buy more. <laughs> Okay. Of of the the vintage sparkly ones or what? The clasp ones? Who is it, honey? Okay. So I believe this is the one you were talking about. What was her name? Teresa? Huh? Teresa? Teresa Cecil. Teresa Cecil, is this the one you're speaking of? The totes were 33, including shipping, Rebecca. That that's everything together. They're 22 and then eight dollars. I'll have to go look again. But they were 33 total. Um, tell me if this is the first the bracelet that you were talking about, though. What is the largest? Sure, I have, Delisa. I have a men's extra large. Okay. So this is the first one. Hopefully this is the one. I'm not seeing her comment, but hopefully it is. Oh, is it Zeph? Is that the same? Okay. Okay, so this was the first bracelet. This was the second one. So the rose and the other flower. Oh, you're Teresa, yes. Okay. Okay, cool, Zeph. Or Teresa. No, I'm being confused. All right. So those are those two guys. You I hope that clarified. You got, got it, honey? Okay. Okay. Um, so the tote bags, yes. Let me let me look at it again. So the tote bag is fifteen dollars. Hold on. Yeah. The tote bags, the tote bags I just showed are fifteen dollars and they ship for eight. Total of 23, okay? Have all the extra large sold? I do not know, Delissa, because um, Hamish is doing that. How do you, did a lot of the flannel sell, honey? About five of them? Okay. You know what, Delissa? When we're done, will you text Hamish now? Say, it's Delissa. If you have any extra larges left, will you show me? Oh, here's an extra large right here. Look, I had my daughter put it on. <laughs> So this is Miranda, <laughs> and this is an extra large. This is um, browns, tans, and blacks, and it goes down into like um, oranges and tans. So this one is still available. If you liked it, Delissa, this is number H. So that's one of them. Number H. Did or show rope bag. Letter H. I the rope basket. Watch. There's tote bags and rope baskets. And no. How much are the baskets? The baskets are different. 40, 35, 30. Uh, 45, 
25, 25, and 40 on the baskets. Thank you. You're welcome. Okay. And then we've got, I think I answered your questions on the totes, right? Okay. Let's move on to, how about this hat? Who likes hats? Tell me. Because this one is tight. Okay. This is a wool hat that I actually bought at a super expensive store in Vegas because it is adorable, right? It's adorable. This is a great wool hat. Um, I'm sad to say that Melanie doesn't wear hats, so I don't know why I keep collecting them. But, <laughs> but it looks great, right? And I always think I should wear hats. Aw, thank you, Catherine. You're gorgeous, according to Catherine. Yes, you know. Oh, thanks, Kat. Ah, Miranda just blushed two shades of red, and then she mm -hmm. said thank you. So this is um, a red wool hat with a black braided band, and it is $45, which is, it's not a lie. Okay, I paid $150 for this hat, guys, but it's $45 for you guys. If anybody is a hat wearer, it is great. So this would be your red wool hat if you wanted a red wool hat. Okay, let's do, how about these guys? So these are super fun throw blankets. Super, super fun. Okay, so we have, you get that Mexican, New Mexico feel. It's a loosely woven, fabulous blanket. They're actually pretty darn big. It's 72 by 48. They're just really, really cool. You could put it on the couch. Wear it as a scarf. Just kidding. Don't wear it as a scarf. But they're really, really, really pretty. So this one, this coloring, they're all different. So we have to remember the coloring. This is a handwoven blanket, 72 by 48. This one is, is going to be blanket number four. It is, what the heck's my price? $24. So $24 for this big old blanket, and it's going to ship for 10 okay? And this is blanket number four. $24 ships for 10 blanket number four. This one, same size and all. This one just has different coloring. I love the pastels in this one. This is blanket number two. If you wanted this blanket, again, same size. They're so soft too. Do I wish you guys could feel them? They're very just loosely woven and like lightweight. Wonderful. I know. I have them very. I have them cheap. I know. All right. So that is it. Blanket number two. Let's do this one. This one's got the really cool minty kind of colors in it. So you've got mint, grays, blacks, a little bit of like pinks and purples woven in there. Again, hand woven. This is blanket number one. If you liked this one. Okay. This one, pinks, blacks, and grays. This one's beautiful too. You've got a lot of that navy native feel in there but i love that they just don't have the traditional colors and not the darker bolder You've got these really light pastels that you can add to any decor that you have 24 dollars, and this one is missing its other tag okay so you would say pink on this one i guess because i don't know what number it is or letter oh here it is look it's right here without a all right, you would say pink, <laughs> blanket on that one. <laughs> and um, yeah, okay, so there's that. Let's see, guys, now we wanna do, we did that, how about, this guy's kinda cool, well, he's really cool, actually. So this is a vintage piggy bank. You can see the slot is right, see the slot's right there. This guy, he is marked under there and he, he is $45 and he's going to ship for 15. Very cool. He's in really, really good condition. If anybody would like this vintage ceramic bank. I love this dude. Look at him. 
Those little scarves all flying. Isn't he cute? So that is the vintage piggy bank. Let's put him aside. This one's really cool too. So this is your crushed copper box. You know, crushed copper jewelry box. It's got that, like you can feel it. It's, and it's velvet lined inside and the lining is still in excellent, excellent condition. This cool vintage jewelry box. You can see all the way around. There is no markings, but it's in great, great condition. This guy is 28 bucks, and it's going to ship for 10 This is the vintage copper crushed jewelry box. All right. What else do we want to do? How about... This is really cool. I don't know for any of you guys. What? The first one is going. You want me to show it or? It's coral green and lavender. You're welcome. Okay. Um, this is really cool. This is brand new, never been used. Um, it's going to be like a gold crushed velvet, tassely kind of a guy. I use it around here to just throw on stuff for my staging um but it is actually for sale it is 25 dollars. it'll sh ship for 10 and i don't know what size it is but it is really really cool so this is like a gold throw it could probably maybe a tablecloth but it's got just a great vibe to it and this is fun you can see it's an absolutely you don't have to buy this one actually i want it don't oh, never, never mind i'll keep you this one Okay, what else do we want to do? How's about, oh, how about this? So I made this, this is my very first purse. So I, I made this, this is my very first little bag. I thought it would be perfect for a little girl and it would be perfect for Easter egg hunting too. So it is leather. I dyed that leather myself, by the way. And I was kind of proud of myself, guys. Come on, it's my first purse and I didn't use a um, pattern or anything. So I thought it'd be really cute though. It does have a little button closure to hold it together, but wouldn't it be cute for Easter eggs for a little girl? So this one is mine. Hi, Mandy. Text. Oh, you, Mandy wants the pink blanket. Babe, what? Mandy wants the pink blanket. The pink one's already gone, Mandy. What, which blankets are available? Pink's gone, coral's gone, black's gone. So the mint is the only one available? Okay, Bandy, this is the only one available on the blankets. Do you want this one? Okay, Jerry Chapman said he wants the box. Did he text you? On here, I see Jerry Chapman, if whatever box that you wanted, you gotta text Hamish and tell him what box it was. If it was this one, Jerry, I think this is the one you're talking about. Um, copper box, text Hamish and say at 702-860-8861 and say, I want the copper jewelry box, okay? Well, the pink one's already gone, Mandy. Somebody bought it and I apologize about that. This is the only one I have available. If you want the mint one, I'll put it aside for you. Um, but somebody else already got the other one. And I am very sorry. I don't know. So, but this one's really cool too. I think you'd like it. Well, hopefully you like it. Okay. Where was I, Mer baby? Bag. Oh yeah. So this is my little Easter egg bag or child's purse. I think it's adorable. And if you don't, that's okay. But I made it. So I think it's cute. It's $14, it's gonna ship for five. So if anybody would like my little one. Okay, thank you, Mandy. Mandy wants the mint one, honey. Okay, so all the blankets are gone, guys. Okay, so anyways, $14, gonna ship for five. Handmade by Melanie. Take it or leave it. Okay, 
What else can we do? So how do you guys feel about plants? Who loves plants? Anybody like um, hard to find plants? Because the plants, most of the plants that I have are not the ones that you're going to find at like Home Depot and stuff. At least the ones I'm going to show you are the ones that are harder to find that you have to order. Probably not for Mandy, she's too far away. But if anybody is interested in seeing the shippable plants that I have, then um, please like type in plants or whatever, and I will um, go through just some of the plants that I have that, again, it is cool, huh? um, that are, are a little bit easy to ship. Okay. Okay. LC says love plants. He wants to see them. A couple more people, let me know. So let's get, how about, um, okay, so how do you guys feel about macrame? You want me to, so my, you know, I was planning to move around with the camera and all that, but now I can't move because um, I'm stuck here with the, you like, you want to see some plants too, Michelle? Okay, let's see if I turn it. Sorry, babe. Let me turn it like this. Okay. And put you up. So I do have some really cool macrame, and I have a good um, way to display them. If you want anything else, I'll text you. Oh, Melanie, thank you. Mandy has been really helpful. Or Melanie's helping Mandy. Definitely show the macrame and the plants. Okay, love plants. Lots in the... F oh, I'm sorry, Angela. That's, that's a bummer, dude. I'm so sorry. Okay. So how do you... Can you guys see? Let me see. I'll get up and down. How's that sound? I'll take my shoes off. Okay, so I don't really think we should do the vessels because they're expensive to ship. But so that's not working, huh? Let's see. I'm gonna get this out of here and put it down now. Okay, so this macrame here, you can see I've got my special little heart knot that actually does have a name, but I cannot remember it right now. It's about yay. I don't know how many feet that is. It's not a real long one, but it is very pretty. And it has this whole thing here at the bottom. This macrame here is $15. You would say macrame number one if you were interested in this one. Macrame number one. <laughs> I chose the red and white one, Veronica. So it, you can, can you see it? Yes. Okay. Macrame number one. If you would like this one, it's $15. This is actually an old lamp. Remember the scone dilly that went over the top like back in the day? I glued it up and put it in there. You know, I love the way it looks. Okay. 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 So that is macrame number one. For $15. This is macrame number two. This one's actually made out of jute. And lots of square knots. All of the macrames that I make fit different size pots. So you can go from a large pot to a small pot. I always make them like that because I never know what kind of pot I'm going to put in it. So that is that one. This is macrame number two. It's jute. It's $15. It does have some beadwork on there. A little more authentic 70s kind of vibe to it, I guess. Okay. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> I got it. I got it. Anyone was worried. Don't worry about me. I got it. Okay. What? I got it. This is macrame number three. This one has a ton of square knots. Ton, a lot of beadwork. Lot of square knots all the way down. This is going to be macrame number four. And macrame number four is $20. I put a lot more work into this one. It's going to cost you a little bit more. How long does it take you to make one now? Veronica, now it takes me about 40 minutes to an hour um, to make each one of them. So, yeah, I'm making zero money. 
<laughs> let's just be real. The cord cost me fifty. No, the cord cost me five to ten, depending on the cord. And it took an hour of my time. Yes, I do it because I like it, not because it's a money maker. So yes, so this one is twenty, and this is going to be macrame number three. If anybody is interested, this is a really good one. And. up this one took me forever i'm actually i don't know if i want to get it down are people buying macrame or should i stop with the macrame stop with the macrame okay we're gonna stop okay so this is not a plant you're gonna find at home depot which is cool so this is a pink syngonium so your arrowhead plant, um, your traditional arrowhead been around forever and then they started mutating them and giving them different looks. So they're a little bit, um, well, a lot, let's just be real. Some of them are a lot harder to find. This is a pink one. So you can see it has all that pink in it. So again, you're not gonna find it at Home Depot or Lowe's. So this is, this is a pink syngodium. It's in a four inch pot and this guy's $22. I have two of them. If you wanted one of these, that is it. Beautiful, beautiful plant. And they just obviously keep growing, get bigger and bigger. Let's, oh, you guys got to see this one. I don't know why this is still here. So this is just flipping adorable. Look at this donkey. <laughs> and he's a planter. This little donkey is a mccoy too so i don't know a lot of you guys know about vintage um, pottery this is a mccoy planter and he is 34 dollars, and he fits a little four inch pot in him um just perfectly and it's absolutely adorable and it's collectors it's mccoy so this guy's 34 dollars. you would say planter donkey if you wanted this little dude i'm so tempted to take him home but i have to sell stuff so there he is, and I can look at him every day. Now that is that guy. How about, let's see, something else that's super cool. This is, this guy's really good. It's a Transacathia. He's a really cute little guy. This guy, still I don't see him at Home Depot and stuff. It's not quite as rare. This little guy's $14. It's in a four inch pot. If you were interested in him, it's a trade cicathia. Very cute. And it's got the little underbelly. That's purple. Very cute. Some of these guys turn pink sometimes too, which is fun. But this guy here, no. Okay, so back to the rare syngoniums, okay? This is a pink splash. So there's two plants in here. And do you see how it's polka dotted? So that's the splash part. And then some of the leaves have more pink on them. This guy's $33 and um, hard to find. Again, if you like the rarer plants, these are the ones for you. That's the pink splash. So let's see what else, what else? Aw, somebody's crying, don't cry. What else should we do? God, there's a lot, but I just don't know. Um, have my shoes back on. <laughs> how about how about um how about some vintage handbags? You want to do a couple of those? Oh, do you want to show the artist bag? Oh, the artist bag. Let me show the artist bag again. So this is this is a Vintage Okay. So here we go. I'm not certain who purchased this wonderful bag, but it is sold. And we are showing it so she can show her husband, but it's awesome. Yeah, and it does. And then inside here are compartment, 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 all the way across. Yes. Yes, yes, they are. Yes, exactly. Thank you, Mandy, for answering Michelle. They they are. So syngoniums are just, um, they're really they're like one of the easiest plants, actually, to, um, <laughs> as long as you don't flood it and you don't complete. I mean, just, yeah, once a week. You're good. You're good. So that's um, it's a good um, beginner's plant. It's gonna be like a pothis. 
it, they're just good or or like your regular philodendron. So those are going to just be like your beginner plants. It's super hard to kill them. Super hard. Um, I have some really big plants which are too big to ship. Well, I could, but we don't want to deal with that. Let's see. And another easy peasy plant. Here's two actually. So another easy, nice beginner's plants. This is your regular spider plant. This guy is small and will get big very, very fast. Um, this little guy's five dollars if you wanted the small spider plant. Here's a Hoya carnosa. It's a little bit of crimson in there. Okay, so this guy's five dollars too. Um, that variegation is awesome on both of them. I love the variegated plants. These guys are five dollars if you wanted them. They're going to ship for five dollars too. Five to six, somewhere around there. Okay, I have a much bigger. Hoya um, crimson, which is just gorgeous. This one is growing super fast. So this is that one that I just showed you. It will turn into this very quickly. Um, this guy is 22. This Hoya crimson does not come in the pot, okay? Because that's ceramic. That's a different pot. But you can see these plants are so cool. When the new leaves come in. They have pink on them, and then they turn to this white. Um, creamy you can still see some pink in that one so this guy would be the larger Hoya he's 22 okay anybody wanted that guy um how about some IOD you guys want to see what I have left with IOD I'm gonna do all of it all IOD 10% off today if you would like to do that give me some feedback there okay meanwhile let's do another trivia question Okay, the first person to answer this question for me is going. Mandy, you look. Oh, Mandy's got all kinds of cool stuff. They don't do that here. I have a Hoya plant that's 30 years old. You know what? I have my mom's too. It's pretty darn old. Okay, yes, IOD. Okay, let's do trivia first, though. So the first person who answers this question correctly gets another free item with their purchase, okay? So my next question is, dun, 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 how many daughters do I have? That's it. You don't have to know their names or anything fancy like that, but if you did know their names, you might have another bonus there. <laughs> but how many do I have total? Okay, first one's the winner, winner, chicken dinner. Oh, Cindy got it. Three. Okay, now tell me their names. Let's see if anyone could guess their names. Okay, Cindy. There you go. No, Cindy got it. No, there went. I saw it a second ago. Oh, you're doing it again, you dumb butt. Always trying to tap this screen, guys. Seriously. Okay, three, 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 three. Look, yeah. Oh, my goodness. Okay, wait a minute. Mandy Driscoll won. Okay, Mandy Driscoll got that one three. I'm sorry. Man, they came in like a, I had to go look back. Will you write that down? Okay, Miranda's going to write that down so we don't forget. Okay, Veronica got Miranda. What is the plant with the smaller leaves? That was a spider plant, little baby spider plant, five bucks. Those turn into beautiful and you get babies galore and no, I just don't think they can see back there I have a big one over here and I am uh, I don't think you can I don't Miranda's gonna bring the big spider plant so you can see what it looks like um, here in a second okay one second okay so let's start IOD so how are we gonna do this babe I don't even Okay, so IOD, anything IOD is going to be 10% off today. I think the way we're going to do it, okay, I'm just going to show you the item. We have three or two or one of them, whatever, and then you've got to just be like brick stamp, like um, hardwood plank stamp to Hamish. And we're going to go one, two, three. When that's gone, then they're just gone. Okay, so whoever does it first, and they're going to be 10% off, and they ship for how much? 
IOD ships for eight bucks. So that little baby plant over there will turn into this in like probably six months. They grow really, really fast. And then they make their own children right here. And you cut those babies off and you plant them and you make more of them. So isn't it cool? This one, man, it's just exploding. I need to water it again. These guys really like bright light. Um, you don't have to water them super often. Once a week, again, really hard to kill that one. But it does like to be bright. Like You want it to be in an area that gets a lot of sun, okay? Oh, not the. I just did all that and it's not the spider plant. Um, the Hoya, the little Hoya, or this one? This one? The big one is 28, Pam. The big spider. But you can come over and get that one if you want it. Okay. I, maybe you were talking about this one, Lisa. I don't know. Okay. <clears throat> Let's. Hold on, guys. Let me get a drink real quick. My throat is like going dry. It's a lot of talking. Okay. Here we go. Don't pull your cords out. The big one. Yeah, just come over, Pam. We'll get you the big one if you want it. It'll be easier that way than on here, okay? Okay. Okay, so here we go. IOD. 10% off all IOD today. Ships for $8. This is your Barnwood Plank Stamp. It is $38 minus 10%. I have three of them. Anybody wants this guy? Snap, you're going to text Hamish, say Barnwood Plank. And then he has three, so after the three are gone, then that's all we can do, okay? So we have one, no, I lied. We have two Cubano. Two of this one, you know I use this one a lot. It is a go-to, you can do numerous things with it. I've done my bathroom with it, I've done my front tile with it. Um, it's, it's a good one. So this guy is $27.95. 10% off, and I have two for Cubano. This is from the newest letter sets. This is $38.95, 10% off. This is swoosh. These are wonderful big cursive letters, and I only have one. So that is swoosh. Over here, we have the butterflies. So butterflies are $27.95. I have one. If you want this one at 10% off, this one is a good one. Okay, let's see. Holly Jolly. So these, I have one, two, seven, eight. I have eight of them. Somebody stocked up on the Holly Jolly. So we do not know if they will make this one again. It was the Christmas premiere. Will they stick around for next Christmas? I have no idea. I have eight of them. You want to get this guy? It's $28.95 and 10% um, off. So if you need the Holly Jolly. So again, we don't know if they're going to have them again. You want that Barnwood plate, don't you? you got to text Hamish and tell him, okay? Tell them who you are, too. Okay, so this is retro. You got to text him at 702-860-8861 and tell him you want the Barnwood Plank. This is what this, this one is called retro. It's got two sheets in there, and it's $38.95, 10% off. This one's really cool, too. How much to ship? They're $8. All the stamps are going to be $8 to ship. Now, if you guys have got more than one thing, then we're going to combine shipping for you. So no worries about that, okay? I have one solution. Oh, I just put something in. Where did I put it? Yeah. Okay. The swish is gone. Okay, this is the back plates. I have two of them. 
I said whatever it says on the. Okay, thank you. Twenty. This one's twenty-seven. These are the back plates. I have two, and they cost eight dollars to ship. Where did I just grab it? Okay. This is another one of the seasonal ones. We don't know if they'll be out again. This one's called Evergreen. It's absolutely perfect for your Christmas signs and all like that kind of stuff. It's really got a Christmas feel to it, but it you can also not be Christmassy too if you want to. So this one's $28.95 and it's Evergreen. And I have three of them. Uh, we did retro. Okay, this one's fun. I'm going to use this one now that summer's coming up, unless you guys buy it, and then I won't. Um, this is Seashore. So lots of fun, beachy kind of signs can go out with this guy. It's got the two two layers, so it's $38.95. And I have two for the Seashores. Sea. Shore. Yes. Okay, two. And this is Lady Charlotte. It is um, no longer, they're not making this one any longer either. $37.95 and two sheets again. $8 to ship. And I have three of these. I have one of these left and they don't make this one anymore either. This is Pavo, which is absolutely beautiful, beautiful. But this is it. This one's $37.95. $8 to ship and there are no more of these ever ever again guys okay so let's see i have, have one lemon drop transfer so one lemon drop this guy's 29 bucks 10 percent off all of the iod and what is the transfer ship for sweetie eight dollars to ship that guy you want me to keep going on the iod okay here, Rana, will you like, scoop them up and bring them to me? Um, yeah. Okay, I guess we might as well do this too. Brayers or not, honey? Brayers or not? Sure. Okay. I have six brayers. IOD brayers are um, $15.95. They're 10% off right at this very moment. So that's a good deal. Any letter molds. No, those are all gone, Mel. All gone. Uh, okay, so we do have some brayers. You could just text Hamish and say brayer. <laughs> okay, so these ones. Okay, this is Winter Song. This is the soft black. You can paint it if you want to, or you can leave it just black. It honestly looks cool, just black. 24 by 24. I have three of these guys, and these are no longer made either. These are, uh, that's that. No more on those ones. You have three. And, but I do have three. So if you wanted a winter song, I have one. One of these. Okay. This is Midnight Garden. I have one. And it is 24 by 33 Midnight Garden. I have one. And it's $28.95. 10% off. Veronica Stamp. Okay. Mandy. Mandy wants a brayer, honey. Chasing sunshine stamps. I don't know what you mean. Sister. Oh, the the one over there. Yeah, I'll take it. Okay. So this is the sweet cream, wild honey, and fresh egg signage. Um, it measures fourteen by twenty-four. So I have one of these guys. This one's no longer available. What flower stamp did you use on the little box you made? About two weeks ago. Flower stamp little box. I don't remember making anything, bro. <laughs> I don't remember what I did yesterday, girl. Flower stamp that I don't box. I don't remember, Veronica. I'm so sorry. Um, this is ladies in waiting. This one is no longer available either. I have one if you wanted that one. Let's see. We have, we'll fix, well, I have to fix all this tomorrow. I have two of these. This is the classic pots. I don't think these guys are available anymore either. I think these ones are done too. 
Huh? The yeah, we'll do the molds too. Yeah. Okay, so classic pots. And yeah, I don't yeah, you guys try to figure it out because I just I feel like I can't stop and think because I won't get my train of thought. Okay, let's do some molds, guys. 1995. This is classic elements. I have three. 1995 classic elements. I have three. They ship for the molds. Okay. Ships are five, and then we combine shipping, okay? I have three. Uh, um, this is Fleur, and I have one. This is Wings and Feathers, and I have two. Okay, these guys are all the same price, okay? Um, this is the seashells by the seashore, <laughs> and I have two of these, okay? This is your He Loves Me decor mold. I think this one's um, been retired, too. Molds are 40 there. Wow. Oh, yeah, they're 19 here, Mandy. And 10% off. You're going to get yourself a deal, girl. Um, chasing. Um, some of these people that I don't know, I'll give them discounts. There, a lot of people are buying multiple stuff. Yeah. So I'll, I'll help them out. All that stuff. Okay, Hamish wanted me to tell you guys that he's going to. Wow, I'm going to pull that right off there. Um. That he's going to combine shipping. So once he figures out how much it is to put, because a lot of you guys are buying multiple things, and I love that. Thank you so much, by the way. Super appreciate that. Um, he's going to put it all in one box, and then he's just going to combine that shipping. So once we know what, what size box it needs to be in and how much that box weighs, then you're going to get a better deal. So it's not like eight, five, you know, it'll be a better deal on that shipping, okay? So we just want to make sure you know that. We will do. We're not making any money off the shipping. We, we just go by what it actually costs us to ship it to you. Okay. How about these? I have two of these. Um, how about these, guys? Have you? I don't know. You guys saw me do my garage, and I need to do more projects. These are cool. I have two of them. They're super heavy duty. The brick rollers, very um. Versatile, you could do a lot with it. These guys are $38.95. It's it's a, it probably weighs like eight pounds. Like it's it's like serious. So um I have two if you wanted a IOD brick roller. This is one of the first, I think it's first or second generation transfers by IOD. I only have one of them. It is 24 by 36. And it's got, let me see if I can get. A really cool vintage flower pattern on it and it says floral fabricus I don't know I feel like that's French 1912 so I just have one of these guys but there you go you can see there what it looks like I have it on one of my pieces of furniture at home and I really really like it but this is one of the older ones so I think it's either first or second generation um, might be first. The roller is 85 there, Mandy. Wow. I need to raise my prices, huh? Yeah. <laughs> Hamish says, yeah. Well, I don't know. We just sell them for what we can get for them here, and they're definitely not that much. That's not going to happen. We need pizza. We need to keep our business alive. Okay. <laughs> How about one of Mel's magic misting bottles? So, this is the misting bottle that I use in. So here it is. Um, it is how many ounces, honey? It's like 20 ounces. So look, here's your here is the competition's <laughs> misting bottle. So it's this big and it's a good bottle. Um, you just have to refill it constantly. So here's the one that I sell. Um, you can see it's gonna hold quite a bit more. Water, the mist is going to be really good, but you don't have to keep though refilling it all the time, which I don't like to do. 
So this one here, this is Mel's Magic Misting Bottle, and it's $20. If you would like one of those, I have one, two, three, four, five. I have five of these. Some are white, some are black, but it's the same bottle. Um, and then I do have this smaller one that's not marked. So there's that one. Let's see. That's Mel's Magic Misting Bottle. Can't do DIY paint. That is absolutely not allowed. Um, how's about, huh? No, no, um, how's about, let's see, let's do some fancy scarves. These are cool. Okay. So these are really fun. These are um, vintage high end, another like high end scarf. It's like a blacky velvety with a translucency. This one is $8, super pretty. So, well, I don't think I, no. Anyways, this one's really, really pretty, black velvety and nice and good. This one is $8, so you would just say black velvety scarf if you liked this one. This one is pink and black. It's got love and like kind of like little peace signs and stuff. And it's really pretty. And it's $8 again. It's a little bit bigger. I don't know if you can see. So it's gonna go, yeah, it goes like all, all the way to my knees but it's pretty cute really I know you can who's a scarf person you can do all this stuff with them if you know how to do it well there's that one that's the pink heart love this one is really pretty too these are really cool too for um, decoupaging fabric and stuff like that like I like to cut these things up a lot to use them this one has a really cool design it's like black and pink this one again is eight dollars so this would be like look how it's really cool kind of makes you want to like i don't know maybe not like that don't do it like that <laughs> okay um this one's cool for your um 70s night out of town who remembers forrest gump remember forrest gump you remember jenny <laughs> jenny you remember jenny right so do you remember that she used to wear, like she had a top that was like made out of this material here? You want the love scarf? Okay, text Hamish and tell him that. Oh, cool, Pam. Yeah, okay, so this one reminds me, it's, it's like this um, really shiny, like tiny, tiny little sequences and it is an infinity scarf, but I love it. I don't, I just love the way it feels and it does remind me of Janie. Right? You make a top out of it. So this one again is this one's 15. 15, this would be the sequin scarf. I know I had a rationale. I think I looked it up. Oh look, it's um tapered too. Look how it's see, I know you're supposed to do something special with this. There's a reason for this madness why it's bigger on one side and smaller on the other. I just don't don't know what it is. Maybe you know, Pam, but this one's really cool. <laughs> I love Forrest Gump. I love that movie. Jenny is my, she's my favorite. Okay, so we, I think we're starting to want, how do you guys feel about, um, they were like peas and carrots. They were, Mel. Yes. Okay, speaking of that, how about some movie trivia? Dun, dun, dun. Are you guys ready? So the next freebie is going to go, oh, is that what it is, Michelle? Okay, I love that, that's awesome. Okay, the next trivia is another freebie is gonna be put in your box to go to the first person who can answer this question. It's probably gonna be too easy, you guys are smart, but okay. From what movie is this quote? You complete me from what movie is that quote tell me tell me rage against hamish says it's rage against the machine i don't know about that 
Okay, come on, guys. I'm watching that screen. See who gets it first. Haim says it's Silence of the Lambs. I don't know about that one either. <laughs> Hi, Deborah. Okay, who's got it? It's not popping up. Seriously? Come on, guys. Somebody knows that answer. All right. No? All right, Miranda, watch that screen for a second for me. See who gets it first. <clears throat> Anybody? No. And that said, show me the money, but <clears throat> that no. is not it. It's not show me the money. You complete me. It's an 80s movie. No, 90s? Probably 90s. Mm, probably 90s. It's before I was born. Huh? Tom Cruise. Okay, you're you're getting there, but that's not the name of the movie. Eric and Michelle said that it's on the tip of their tongue. <laughs> Come on, girl. Movie with Tom Cruise. And I'm not gonna give you any more hints. We're not doing that. Um, and anybody? Okay. Not pretty woman. No, not pretty woman. Jerry Maguire, Sue, you got it. That was close. All right. Yay. Jerry Maguire. Okay. Sue's the winner of that one. Are we writing this down? Who's the winner? Okay. Miranda's is this. Okay. Sue. Sue got it. Okay, so I want you guys to check out this. This is like a rain coaty kind of material, but it's so cool. And I love the red. I love it. This is made by Banana Republic. So it is a very nice blazer. What would you call it? So it goes over a button up. Let's see if I can get the button. I absolutely love it. I think it's so very pretty. And then it has the cross belt. So you can cinch it up and be super cute. Like, wouldn't it be cute? Like, with the skirt, like some nice shoes. So, this is very nice raincoat made by Banana Republic. It is in the smaller sizes. Let me see. Um, darn, these buttons are big. They're like um, red um, enamel buttons. They're really, really pretty. <laughs> he got it too. We just went to the first one who got it first. So this is a women's medium. Again, you can see where is that? Banana Republic women's medium. It even has like a chain for the little dilly. And I have this guy at twenty five. So if you wanted this one, twenty five dollars. Really cute, Banana Republic. How do you guys feel? I have like a lot of like leather jackets and who sophistication who likes anybody like affliction tell me i have all right 20 affliction affliction t-shirts that are like in mint condition if anybody likes uh yeah pea coat sherry yeah um if anybody likes affliction please say Yes or yay or nay, because I won't show you guys those. No, I, I guess some of them are women's, but I think they're more men's. Um, what else do we have? I have lots of little. I don't know if you guys want to see these or not. I have like this kind of stuff. You want to see the leather jackets, Pam? So like this kind of knick-knacky stuff if anybody wants to see knickknacky stuff these are three dollars and i can't say even where it came from um zeph you said yes is that yes to the leather or yes to the knickknackies okay miranda hold those what is that i don't know it's just a really cute little fancy shoe that sits on top of your your vanity maybe 
for pretty. You could like drop earrings in it or something like that. They're just um, decor. <laughs> you don't know. <laughs> but I have a bunch of these little guys. Who says yes, yes. Okay, let's look. Wait, you guys are say yes what though? Yes, yes leather. T-shirts. You want to see the Affliction T-shirts? Okay, let's do that. Miranda, will you get them? Uh, yeah. Let me show her. I don't know. Okay, be right back. Okay, we're coming, guys. Hold on. Yeah, I've got that very fast one on that on my rack too. Okay, if you guys want to see this stuff, this is a lot of them. Um, higher, kind of higher end knickknacks. Okay, Luz, you want to see the knick? Okay, hold on. All right. Stay. You know, my plan was to be able to move the camera, like take you guys with me, but that's not happening, right? So, uh, the Affliction t-shirts, what are those? So Affliction, Pam, is just a brand name. Um, yeah, Q-tips, there you go, Vicki. Oh, you could put an airplane in that shoe too, you were, you were correct. Um, Affliction is a brand name, so it's like, um, say, I don't even know what to compare it to, say Nike or something like that. Affliction kind of has its own genre, um, I guess, right? I don't know how to say it. Okay, but it's a very um, expensive brand of t-shirt. I hate that one. Mm -hmm. um, okay, so like this one here, this is from their American Fighter series. So this is an Affliction t-shirt. You can see all the graphics that go with it. So it's this kind of brand. This is a men's medium t-shirt. So as I go through these, are you gonna sell that pink table? Uh, that's already gone, that's sold. Um, right away, Miss Veronica texts me and um, she got it. So here we go, so this would be an affliction. I'm just gonna show you a few. Actually, I don't know if that's affliction. It says affliction, does it? No. Um, yeah, they say it. So this is affliction. Okay, so if you guys are interested, we can get down and dirty, but I, I need to know before I start doing all that. So if anybody is really interested in these Affliction t-shirts, then please let me know. This is kind of what they all, they all have a similar vibe to them. Um, doesn't seem like anybody's too interested in those yet. Let's, huh? No, okay. okay. All right, so we're gonna skip the affliction. Trash. Uh, I don't really want that one. There's okay. I know. I didn't know. All right, so let's do some leather. Leather, leather. This is suede. This is a brown gray suede. This is a women's small, and it is Atlier by Thomas. So I did look up a lot of these too just see what the general price that they go for is. And then I lowered my price by like $20 from what theirs was. So super cute jacket. It's nice and fitted, very soft. It is lined um, and good. So this is a uh, suede. This one is suede. This one here is, this one is 18. So if you wanted this one, you could just say first leather, 18. It's absolutely beautiful. It is a women's small and in great condition. If there's any flaws on these guys, they're not something that I could see that I could tell you about. They're just in great shape. So this would be the first one. What is the price on the t-shirts? All of those t-shirts are 10 bucks. I'm just letting them go. $10, $10, $10. Um, and if you do know anything about affliction, which you might, I mean, they're like 45, 58, 68, and I'm just like $10, just get them out so I can pay the bills, okay? 
That's what we're doing here, guys. Um, this leather jacket, it's a vest and brown crushed vintage leather, very, very soft. And it is a small, this one's $15. This one's by Tribal. Are they cotton or jersey? They're all cotton, all cotton. So that is that leather vest. It's a woman's small and it's super cute. It's got kind of a bikery feel to it, a little bit like 70s. I love it. I've kept it forever. Time to move on. Um, any extra large in those t-shirts, honey? Hold on, Miranda's gonna look, okay, Sue? Um, hold on. And then if you are interested, I'll go. Okay, you wanna see the tees. Okay, we'll go back to the tees, definitely. Oh, that would be cute with transfers. That <laughs> would be cute, Mel. You are right. I might have to take a potty break. My goodness. Um, there's one extra large. Which one? Okay. How are we going to do this? What size do you want in? Any extra large. Hold on. Um, red. Red. Okay, Sue. So this one right here is extra large. So this would be a red extra large affliction if you wanted that one. Well, that one is cool. You can see it's it's pretty good size. Look, it's like um above my knees, but not that far. So that one, if you like that one, Sue, red extra large, or anyone who likes it. Let's see. This, you want me to just go through all of them? Let's just do all of them. Okay, so this is American Fighter Division. This one is a large. American Fighter Division, large. And it's that in the front. On the back, it's got a star. So let's call this one American Fighter Star. And it's the second one I showed. And again, these are all 10 bucks. They ship for five. This is a medium. Got this star on it. And it's really kind of cool. Look, it has like hand um, sewn stitching. I like that one. It's pretty cool. This one's American Fighter. Nice. And, huh? Okay. Is it not? No, this, this one. It's just, oh, this is Affliction Live Fast, it says. And the lettering is, um, is the red XL the same? Not the same shirt. It's different shirt, babe. No, the first one's an XL, the second one's an L. The star is an L, not an XL. Okay. All right. So this would be gray hand stitched. Let's say stitched affliction. This one is a medium. Medium. Okay. Let's see. This is another American fighter one. It is a medium black. This is the front of it. And the back looks like that. This is a medium. Uh, another American fighter. This is a large. That is very similar to that other one, but different. And it's got the the big A on the front, 1974, worldwide. You know what? You can also do these T-shirts get um, confusing. Okay, Mandy wants the red extra large, please. That one already went. Um, Sue got that extra large, Mandy. Do you just need extra large? Um, you know what? I For the confusion of these t-shirts, if you screenshot me just with your phone, then that would that would, might help when you send that to Hamish. Um, okay, there's this one. Sorry, Mandy. Uh, this one here. Huh. This one's a trip. Okay, I don't know what size it is. I'm going to guess it's... We're gonna guess it's a medium, but check this one out. 
Somebody's car alarm's going off outside. So it looks like this, okay? And it's got, what is that, a big shotgun, like an all time. And then the back, but look at this. If you got bored, you can flip it. <laughs> so I'm going to guess this is a medium, probably. Me too. Ask him to send you a screenshot. There's no way. I can't even hear anything because of this idiot's car alarm out here. Okay, so Sue's got the red XL. What else? Move this last one. 1974. And okay, this is the gun T. No, it's different. Gun. Yeah. No. Hold on, guys. Hold on. Okay. Okay. So this is the, this is the gun one. Okay. Gun one. Okay. Yeah. That one's to take it to Hamish. It's the gun one. Are we hanging in there? Um, you know, I don't really know. I, I guess I, I just don't. Um, it seems like they might be both, but they don't say on them. This is a medium. But it seems bigger, so I would say this one's probably a men. Um, this one, gray, a lot of graphics here, a lot of graphics. So we're gonna call this one gray medium. Let's just let's call it a fleur. Gray medium fleur, okay? Gray medium fleur. Um, so it does have some metallics. Really catches. Most of these are like brand new. Nobody even worn them. Very fun. Gray medium fluor on that one. This is a medium also, but see, this feels bigger. So it feels like a men's to me. Okay. And we'll go gray medium lions, but it, it definitely feels like a men's if you look at like how long it is and stuff. So gray medium, this one would be the lion if you wanted this one. Okay, guys. Okay. That's it for affliction let me show you this jacket because i think that somebody would like it because i love it um so this one's super fun this is made by carmar it's a woman's small i don't know where it is oh it. oh sorry um carmar it's woman's small this is what is this dyed denim um Teal. <laughs> Teal dyed Devon is nice and distressed. It's got some good holes. Definitely oversized. Can you guys see the see the tears? Like it has those natural tears, but it, I mean, they're just, it's cute, it's comfortable, it's soft, and definitely oversized. So I have the sleeves rolled up twice. So this guy is $38. If you like this look, which I like this look, then you yeah, could have this one if you wanted. So this is your blue dye denim jacket. Um, what did I call it? Women's Distress Blue Denim. It's really, really cute. And um, it's good. It's like soft. It's not like um, uncomfortable denim at all. We're going to have to end or take a break here in a minute because I got a potty. <laughs> I'm potty. Okay, so look at this guy. Back to the leather. This one is adorable. This is made by Red Leather Eddy. It's all, again, all really soft, nice leather. And it is a cute little vest. Zip it up, wear it down. 
It's pretty cute, pretty fancy, and um, not bikery. Zaf, are you texting Hamish? I hope. I hope you are. This guy is forty-five dollars for this vest. Oh, it even has like a little little deals there. And let's do one more leather, and then no, let's not. Okay, I think I'm done. I gotta go potty. <laughs> I hope you guys got everything that you wanted. Um, if there's confusion, you know, please make sure you're texting Hamish. We are going to do our best to get everybody what they wanted. Mandy, you know, we're going to get you everything that we can, okay? And we will definitely keep in contact with all of you guys. You know where we are. You know where to find us. And we will combine shipping. And I'm sorry there's sad people up there. I see sad faces. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to make anyone sad. Hopefully that was an accident when you hit that button. <laughs> I didn't really make you cry. I hope I didn't. Okay. Thank you. I wanted to say thank you guys so much. Thank you for your support. Thank you for being in there with me. And for the last and final trivia question, are you ready for your 70s music? Okay, this is 70s music trivia. Ready? Who sings a song called Brand New Key? Who sings a song called Brand New Key? Sing it for him. Do you want me to sing it for you? Brand New Key goes, I ride my bicycle by your window last night. <laughs> Who knows that song? I really feel like you're bored of me. <laughs> Come along, if I got something I need. I've got a pan new pair of roller skates. You got a brand new key. Melanie, Angela Thomas won. Yay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> that was fun. Yay. Okay, guys. Thank you so much, Angela Thomas. You're going to have a little freebie there, too. Thanks, guys. Huh? Okay. 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 So Hamish is requesting, please, if you have not in your text sent your name your and your email address and your shipping address, please do that now. Hamish is going to get it all together. And tomorrow? Invoices will go out to tomorrow to your email. So please um, check your email. And your spam, because sometimes they go to spam, okay? So do all that, so that way, as soon as we get paid, the faster we can get them shipped to you, okay? So remember, we need your name, we need your email address, and we need your shipping address in that text. All right, and... Thank you. Okay, thank you. Mandy, um, do you, did Mandy, I don't know anything about Mandy. Okay, Mandy. I need you to email me because I know you don't want to text, okay? So let's email. You can email me at, you're going to go shop, S-H-O-P, the at sign, windmillvintagedesigns.com. Okay, Mandy? Shop at windmillvintagedesigns.com. Can we, will you type that in there for Mandy? Miranda's going to type it in there for you, Mandy. Hopefully you're still here. Maybe you could tag her. I don't know if you can. Okay, cool, Pam. That works. Okay, shop at windmillvintagescience.com. Okay. Um, thank you, guy. Oh, there she is. Mandy Driscoll. Okay. All right, Mandy, did you get that email? Okay. All right, guys, thank you so much. It was really, really nice. I appreciate all your support. And um, okay, I'll see you soon, very, very soon. Bye, guys.